So welcome back everyone. I'm super excited about bringing on my next guest. We're live on Facebook, so hi to everybody out there. Uh, I have with me Rita Cartwright. Rita is an entrepreneur, she's an author, and a speaker, and she's also been on my show uh, 2018, we figured that one, and a couple times now she's back again. Welcome back to the show. Tell everybody a little bit about yourself and why we're here today. Awesome. Hi, once again, my name is Rita Cartwright. And Carol did a wonderful job in introducing who I am and what I am about. But uh, today, actually, um, October 1st, 2002, 22 years ago, I became an entrepreneur. So I opened up my first business um, 20 years ago, and I opened my second business five years ago. And that's on the business side, and I am also an author and a speaker. And on the personal side, I'm a mother, a grandmother, and a great-grandmother. Wow, you wouldn't know that. <laughs> but you're here to talk about this book, and I want to, today's a special day. And I know yes. before you came on, you told me you yes. wanted to be on on the 1st for a reason. Go ahead. This month, October, is Domestic Awareness Month. And one of the stories that I cover in my book is being a survivor of domestic violence. And so that's one of the stories. And so today, that's why I wanted to come on, especially in October, because it is Domestic Violence Awareness Month. Now, you have a book that you've written, and it's a new book, and yes. you're so excited about yes. it. It's How to Heal Your Broken Heart. And you can get this on Amazon. You also have a link that we're going to tell everybody about. But I'm going to open up the lines of the audience for everyone to get entered into win. And we're going to talk about this. This is a signed autograph copy. This is something that you helped yourself, but you helped others yes. by helping yourself. Yes. Uh, I, so I want everybody to see it on Facebook right there. But I do want you to tell everybody a little bit about this book. Uh, folks, anybody who has dealt with any kind of um, domestic violence, whether it's you or someone that you know, this book could really help them. Go yes. ahead. And so one of the stories, as I was saying, is on domestic violence. I covered three stories uh, in my book, and there are stories within the stories, but I highlighted the three main stories that caused me to have a broken heart. And so the next story is on infidelity, and the third story is on losing a loved one. Mm. And so the book is organized as such where that is section one, my three stories, and section two, I go into eight biblical principles um, that goes into the word of God that will help a person with a broken heart to heal. So you can get a broken heart many ways, even though many ways. Yeah, only so, cover three ways. So right. So we're talking like domestic violence, but infidelity, and then of course the loss of a loved, loved one. one. So and uh, almost anyone out there listening to yes. this, it's not just for women. No. Okay. This and the one that's dealing with a broken heart that need you know some guidance of to heal. Yeah. If they believe in the Word of God. Okay. Because it's through the Word of God and faith that brings about this healing. And this is what helped me to heal. So we've got our lines open here for everyone to get entered into one. This is a signed autograph copy of the book. It's How to Heal Your Broken Heart. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's you or someone that you know. Our number here is 602-277-5369. And toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. I'm going to let everyone call throughout the rest of the show for mm -hmm. this. You can go up onto Amazon. Yes. You can get it for me. Um, you get entered into win for free. But you can also go onto her link. It's bit.ly forward slash your broken heart. You can buy it there. But right now, everybody just listen up. I want to talk about mm -hmm. this, you know. Um, you wrote this because obviously you were dealing with something like yes. this, right? And you also are very connected with God, yes. right? Yes. And I want you to explain how this all came about real quickly. The book itself? Everything. Okay. <laughs> now, part of the chapter on losing a loved one involved losing my husband. And 20 years ago, my husband thought it was a good idea. He thought my life was interesting enough. He said, you should write a book. And so I wrote a few of the chapters. 20 years ago, and I put it away because I didn't, there was no purpose for it. And so recently, about 
five months after my husband passed, a prophet gave me a prophecy, said, I see you writing a book. And this book is to help women to heal from having a broken heart. And so that's how the, the book was birthed. And you know what? That started 20 years ago. Started 20, 20 years away. ago, and I put it away because there was no purpose. And so now God gave me a purpose for the book mm -hmm. uh, in writing the book. And I didn't have section two, the eight biblical principles, eight, uh, 20 years ago. So the eight biblical principles came about recently from my relationship with God. And while I was going through um, with my husband, because my husband was sick a year before he passed. And so I, those, uh, that year I applied these biblical principles uh, to heal from that and from the other heartbreak uh, situations as well as I mentioned in the book. The way that I hear it is that not only do you have the stories, but when you hear other people that go through certain things, it always helps, mm -hmm. right? Is yes. that the stories are there uh, for that? But then you also have the biblical principles yes. that you bring in to also now uh, almost, it sounds like, solidify so much what, how you, what you believe in. Is that correct? Well, the way that is laid out, if I answer it correctly, it would take these biblical principles in order to even start the healing process. Okay. What is number one? I'm not going to give them all not the even, way. Just one. Give me one. <laughs> one is faith, as I have already mentioned. Now, I'm That's mentioning good. a couple of more. And another one is prayer. And another one is spending time with God daily. And there are five more biblical principles. You know, sometimes people think, well, that's sort of like a given. No. No. You know what? It's not. No. And that's, sometimes we need these books out. And I love that you've written it. And I'm so glad mm -hmm. you came today. Um, I want to just tell everybody that we've got our lines open here. And I'm going to let everyone call throughout the rest of the show to get entered into win a signed autograph copy of the book. It's How to Heal Your Broken Heart. We talked about, obviously, domestic violence. Mm -hmm. But uh, you said infidelity, infidelity. also. You, you mentioned a loved one. Uh, the death of a loved one. Mm -hmm. So you can uh, either go to Amazon, you can also call in here, get one in, entered in to win a signed autograph copy from me, which is 602-277-5369 or toll free it's 1-866-536-1100. You can also go to her, it's a link that's for the book that you can purchase the, the book there. It's bit.ly forward slash your broken heart. I know these go by fast. I wish everybody could do 30s, but just what, what do you have in the, in, the, in the future thinking of what you're going to do? More books or anything like that? Well, according to God, he has more books to birth through me. I feel okay. I'll receive that. And so I do plan to write more books. And this was my first book. And so, yes, I do plan to write more books. Do you feel that when you wrote this book, as you were doing it, mm -hmm. how much did it help you heal? Her uh, yes, uh, yeah. yes, and yes. anybody listening, you know, you know, I, we all know someone. Yes, we all, unfortunately, yes. we know somebody that's hurting, yes. right? Because and, but, God used me now to minister to other wives who have lost their husbands and other mothers who have lost their sons because I lost my oldest son as well. Oh my goodness, you've been through so much, oh, Rita. yes, but yeah. glory to God, I'm still here to tell you about it. Absolutely, to write about <laughs> it. To write about it. To write yes. about it yes. and to be able to share yes. this, yes. which yes. I love that you're here to do yes. that. Thank you for being here again. You're welcome, God. Bless. And i tell you something, folks, you know, um, I, like I said, we all know somebody who has dealt with something that has broken someone's heart. And there's so many different things. But in this, I think it's wonderful the way that you brought out the three uh, mo most important, I think the highest ones, but then of how you brought God into yes. it and the principles, yes. how those principles can help you get through it. Yes. So most we've got definitely. our lines so we've got our lines open here for everyone to get entered in to win a signed autograph copy of the book. It's how to heal your broken heart. Our number here is 602-277-5369. Toll free it's one 866 536 I'm gonna let everyone uh, call throughout the rest of the show. Also, you can go up onto the link. It's bit.ly forward slash your broken heart.